Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Java interview questions. That is, what is the difference between JRE and JDK variations of Java? Let me answer. So, there are two variations of Java that we can download and install in our machine. Sometimes we may have to download the JRE variation of the Java and then install in our machine. Or sometimes we may have to download the another variation that is JDK variation of the Java, download and install it. Okay. But when do you need JRE variation of Java to be downloaded and installed in your machine? And when do you need this JDK variation of the Java download and install in your machine? That we'll understand by understanding the difference between JRE and JDK here in a detailed manner. First, let's get started with JRE. JRE stands for Java Runtime Environment. Okay. JRE stands for Java Runtime Environment. So, who need to download this JRE variation of the Java and install in their machine? This is for the end users who want to run some Java based softwares or applications. Okay. Those softwares or applications which only will run in your machine if you have Java already there in your machine. Okay. Such kind of people will be there or such kind of end users will be there who want to run some Java software, uh, Java based software in their machine. Some software they need, but that software will run only when Java is there in your machine. Such kind of end user, if you are, then it is suggestible to download the JRE variation of Java and then install in your machine so that after installing this JRE variation of the Java, Java will be there in your machine. And on the top of that, you can run your whatever the applications that need Java to run. Okay. You can install and run the Java based applications that need Java to run in your machine. If your purpose is to run, just run the softwares which need Java for running, then install the J download the JRE variation of the Java and install it. For example, Eclipse ID. So this particular software is there guys. Okay. Eclipse ID is an editor. Okay. This software will only run when Java is already installed in your machine. If Java is not available in your machine, then you cannot run the Eclipse IDE. Then you cannot use this. Even though you install this Eclipse IDE, it is not going to open. It will, when you try to open, it will say, this Eclipse IDE software needs Java to run. Some kind of message you will get. Again, you have to download the JRE variation of the, uh, you know, uh, Java and download and install it, okay? So that's what happens. So for such simple needs where you need to run some Java based applications, the applications which run only on the top of Java, we may have to choose to download the JRE version of the Java and install it. Okay. It won't be suitable. JRE variation of the Java is not suitable for Java developers. Why? Because it will not include any development tools. If development tools are not there, what the developers will do by downloading the JRE version of the Java? Java. If if developers download the JRE variation of the download uh, JRE variation of the Java and install them in their machine, they cannot do any development. So what is the use for developers? It's only intended for end users for running some Java based applications. Okay. But coming to the JDK guys, JDK stands for Java Development Kit. Okay. So uh, if I have to explain it more, JDK is equal to JRE, J, when you download the JDK version or JDK variation of the Java, right? Along with JDK, you will get JRE plus development tools. Okay. Development tools also will get what are the development tools that are required for developers for developing the applications using Java, right? That extra development tools you will get with JDK, but not with JRE. JRE, there are no development tools for developing Java application, applications. Okay. But in JDK, JDK is equal to it includes JRE in, along with that extra thing is development tools for developers. Okay. So JDK is equal to JRE plus development tools. The full form is Java development kit. It is intended, intended for, it's intended for Java developers guys, for the people who want to develop. Okay. For the developers of Java. Okay. Who want to develop the applications based on using some Java or write some Java code. Okay. Who want to write some Java code. Okay. So for such people, JDK variation of the Java need to be downloaded and installed in their machines. Okay. Includes development tools, uh, like uh, writing for writing, compiling and debugging the applications. Okay. For building the applications, whatever the development tools that Java developers need, 
all will be there in the Java development kit that is JDK variation of the Java, but in JRE, it won't be there. The development tools won't be there. Okay, so it will be only suitable for the end users. JRE will be only suitable for end users for running some Java based applications where JDK is suitable for developers who want to develop the applications using Java. Okay, so hope guys you got the difference between JRE and JDK variations of Java. And uh, if you want to download the JRE variation, just open uh, browser and uh, search for Java. Java, just press enter. You'll get the website of Java, java.com. If you go to this uh, official website of Java and if you simply click on download Java, right? It is not going to download the JDK variation. Rather, if you download from here, from this java.com website, if you try to click on download Java, JRE variation, okay? JRE variation will come. And at the end, they are giving us a notification saying, if you are a software developer looking for JDK downloads, then click on this links they are saying, okay? So if you are not a developer, directly download Java from the official website of Java guys. Download Java, JRE variation will be downloaded. But if you are the developer, this is not the button that you have to click, okay? If you click this button, you'll get JRE variation. But if you are the developer, you need development tools, you just need to click Java AC development kit. It will take you to a different website from where okay, you can get the JDK. Okay. JDK variation you will get JDK 21, 79, so on. Okay. From here, you can download the JDK variation, which is suitable for Java developers. Okay. Otherwise, from the official website here, if you directly download, it will download the JRE variation of Java, which is not suitable for developers. Rather, it is suitable for end users who want to run some software which is based on Java. Okay which will run only on the top of Java. So hope guys, you got the answer for this question. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.